Hi everyone, my name is Demis. And I'm Ben. And in this video, we're going to be explaining what each photography app in the Adobe Creative Cloud does. Adobe Photoshop Lightroom Classic. Lightroom Classic is probably the most used photo editing software out there. It's best known for color grading images on a desktop. And as an example, you can turn your images from this to this using this app. To color grade an image, you simply import the files into the program, open up the develop tab and adjust the sliders on the right side. You're able to adjust everything from exposure, contrast, color balance, sharpness, and so much more. Lightroom Classic is also a great way to post-process in batches through the use of presets and copying and pasting settings from another image. On top of this, a lot of photographers use Lightroom Classic as a photo management system for efficiently cataloging, organizing, and rating their images through the library tab. This way, your files will always be neat and easy to find. Adobe Photoshop Lightroom. The main difference between Lightroom Classic and Lightroom is that the latter is cloud-based, meaning that if you import your images into Lightroom on a desktop, it will automatically sync with all your other devices too, such as your phone and your tablet. This is especially useful when you're traveling and on the go and want to continue to edit your images in different locations using different devices. On top of being able to color grade using the same tools and sliders as Lightroom Classic, on the Lightroom app on mobile devices, you are able to capture images in RAW format, this means you can capture, edit, and share your images in a much more streamlined way right in the app. Adobe Photoshop. Photoshop is used when you want to create composites and add different effects to your images. Through the use of layers and layer masks, you can create composite images and artworks which take your photography edits to the next level. However, Photoshop isn't just used by photographers. It is also an industry standard for illustrators, artists, and graphic designers too and it can be used to create digital paintings, posters, advertisements and all kinds of digital art using the many built-in brushes. For photographers, Photoshop and Lightroom work very well hand in hand. For me, the usual workflow would be to color grade the image using Lightroom and then I open up the file in Photoshop from Lightroom to enhance or edit the image further. Then, once I click save in Photoshop, the updated image will automatically appear back in Lightroom to be exported and also to be organized in the folder as well. Photoshop is mainly used on desktop, but has recently been introduced for the iPad as well. Adobe Photoshop Express. Photoshop Express is a mobile app which is focused on quick, easy and on-the-go editing. With a few simple clicks, you're able to edit and touch up your images so you can share them with your friends and to social media much faster. There are hundreds of built-in filters for you to choose from to edit your photos, and there are also quick fix tools that allow you to do things to your photos such as heal blemishes, adjust perspective, assemble collages, and so much more. And finally, Adobe Photoshop Camera. Photoshop Camera is also a mobile app. It allows you to apply lenses and filters before you even take the shot. And it's packed with amazing AI powered features that enhance your photos in a much quicker and simpler way. Being able to see what the final image will look like when a filter is applied before you actually take the shot is super powerful as it will allow you to compose your images and save time in future edits. So that's it. We hope this video has helped you understand what each photography app does in the Adobe Creative Cloud. Have fun editing your photos. Bye.